Welcome to Electronic Medium, Life is Paranormal. I am Judy, and on this channel we research the afterlife using today's technology. Today we're going to talk about Lori Bellow Daybell's brother, Alex Cox. If you haven't seen the three spiritual readings I've done so far, asking the spirit realm about Tylee and JJ, check them out after this. Alex Cox always seems to be in the mix. If you'd like to be a part of the Electronic Medium Life is Paranormal community, please like and subscribe. Ring that notification bell so you don't miss any live streams that I do or any upcoming videos. We will be asking the spirit realm about Alex Cox, and I will be asking for him directly. Alex Cox was born January 18th, 1968. His given name is Alexander Lamar Cox. Him and Lori are the children of Barry and Janice Cox. you got to feel bad for the parents here. Heartbreaking, right? So Alex Cox was 51 years old when he passed away. Just like everyone else in Lori's life, he's dead. He did pass away here in Chandler, Arizona under suspicious circumstances. Apparently, Alex has been up in Lori's business for a mighty long time. Alex had a little tiff with Lori Vallow's husband number three. His name was Joseph Ryan. He's Tylee's biological father. Alex was arrested in 2007 for tasing Joseph Ryan twice during um, a child exchange. Alex Cox also threatened to kill Joseph Ryan, allegedly. A year later, Alex pled guilty to an uh, aggravated assault charge in the second degree, and he spent three months in jail. Apparently, Alex was a little pissed off about this. All he seemed to ever talk about in jail was getting back at Joseph Ryan. On July 11th, 2019, Alex Cox shot and fatally wounded Charles Vella. He shot Charles twice in the chest after claiming that Charles hit him in the head with a baseball bat. On September 8th, 2019, Tylee and JJ were seen at Yellowstone Park with Lori Vello Daybell and Alex Cox. The last time Tylee was seen was at Yellowstone with the family September 8th. On September 17th, a doorbell camera catches Joshua JJ Vello playing out front in front of Lori's apartment in Idaho. On September 24th, Lori notifies the school she's going to be homeschooling JJ and she notifies the school that she's not going to be bringing him back. On October 9th, 2019, Tammy Daybell, Chad Daybell's wife, says a masked man came up to her with a gun and pulled the trigger. She said she was shot at several times, but the gun misfired. She called it a paintball gun, but I'm not so sure. Ten days later, Tammy Daybell passed away. On November 29th, 2019, Alex Cox marries Zulima Pastenez. Pastenez? They got married in Las Vegas. He changed his name to Alexander Lamar Pastenez. Still not sure if I'm saying that right. Not even two weeks after Alex marries Zulima, he is found passed away in the bathroom at their Chandler, Arizona home. He passed away on December 12th. Apparently, Zulima's son, 25-year-old Joseph Lopez, was the one that found him in the bathroom, passed out in his own feces. When Joseph Lopez calls 911, he tells them his mother's boyfriend is on the floor. Did he even know they got married? I'm thinking not. Oh, and I have a question. Where was Lori between November 29th and December 12th? Where was she? Does anyone know? So on December 12th, Alex Cox passes away, and on December 20th, the police announce that they will be searching for Tylee and JJ. So I'm going to be doing a spirit box session, reaching out to the spirit realm. I'm going to be asking directly for Alex Cox. Where are the children? Alex. Okay, so I'm going to use the PSB7 spirit box. Can you guys see that? And it's just a scanning radio. For those of you who don't know, the spirits, I, I, I've been told, can manipulate audio, and they use the frequency to communicate, and um, boy, do they ever 
do something with it. So let's give it a shot. We're going to ask for Alex Cox today. I want to know what his deal is. What is what's your deal, Alex? Okay, I'm going to just turn up my I'm going to turn up the amp so we can hear it. The only thing I have the PSB7 hooked up to right now is a little bit of noise reduction using a noise reduction guitar pedal. So I'm going to turn this up so we can hear it. It'll cut out some of the scanning. So. Good. I'm looking for Alex Cox. Alex Cox, why did you hate Joseph Ryan so much? I mean, all the stuff that you've done, you must have really loved your sister. That's all I can say. Alex Cox, why did you dislike Joe Ryan so much? You. Like I said, you must have really loved your sister to do all this stuff for her. Were you angry that you went to jail because of Joseph Ryan? Did that, you know, piss you off? Right, and what was your deal with Charles Vallow? I mean, you didn't like him or Joseph or Tammy Daybell, apparently. Just tell me what was going on, Alex. Tell me about the day you went to Yellowstone with Lori and Tylee and JJ. Tell me about that day, Alex. Can you? In the spirit realm, anyone tell me more about that day? Thank <laughs> you. 
Any spirit can answer this. Did Alex have something to do with the children? Did, they, did Alex do something to the children? Can you tell me? Talk to me about Tylee. Did you help do something to Tylee? I know these were, I believe these were two, two different locations, two different occurrences. <laughs> Tylee still in Yellowstone? That's um, a question we all want to know. Is Tylee still in Yellowstone? Okay, let's go to JJ. Let's talk about JJ. Alex, can you hear me? Right, Alex, where is JJ's physical body right now? Where is JJ? Yeah. 
somebody called. Did that sound, did that sound falling? Alex, where was Lori between the time you got married and the time you passed away in that two weeks? Did you see Lori that day or the day before you passed away? Where was Lori? I think I heard Charles Bellow say, I told him, <laughs> he probably did tell him to watch out. Alex, how did you die? Were you poisoned? Were you on something? What happened? How did you die? <laughs> Another question, one more question for you, Alex Cox. Where are you now? Can you describe to me where you are now? All right, any spirits that helped me today, I appreciate it. If you told me anything about Alex, if it was Alex that answered me, I appreciate it. Don't re don't really even know what to say to, to say to you, man. Okay. All right, guys. I'm going to have to listen back to all that. Um, I did hear some responses in there, but, uh, you know, I have to listen back and listen back to see what I recorded. Okay, well, by now I know what you know. And based on the results here, I my next video will be a dowsing rod session. 
you need to get a hold of me for any reason, you can email me at afterliferesearch1111 at gmail.com. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you like what I do. Also, come and see me on Facebook, Electronic Medium Life is Paranormal. And now I have a merch store on Facebook, Electronic Medium Life is Paranormal Merchandise. I'm so excited about that, you guys. Not only do I have my own merch on there from Teespring, but I'm also an Amazon affiliate. Be sure to check out the links. There's cool stuff, crystals, jewelry, clothing, candles. Oh, and don't forget ghost gear.
Is my thing. My light. Thank you. 